I'm going to try to get to the bottom of which is faster in Unity C Sharp or Unity Script. Uh, it's hotly debated. Uh, forms have been devoted to this subject um, with kind of inconclusive results. Uh, right now, I have a test set up for Lean Tween. It's a stress test, and it goes through a couple of the Lean Tween functions. Um, animating 6,000 cubes at once. Uh, I have the Lean Tween, C-sharp version of Lean Tween. Um, I picked Lean Tween because it's a very uh, large um, library, um, doing a lot of complex stuff. Um, and also all those functions are duplicated in JavaScript, so we'll test JavaScript later. All right, let's fire this up. So I added a feature to FPS Graph that gives you a analysis of the uh, performance either by clicking on FPS Graph or as I am now, I'm just having it fire up at the end of uh, 12 seconds. Okay, so we got 9,427. Uh, try to remember that number. Um, now we will try the same thing, but I am going to use the JS uh, Unity Script version of Lean Tween. And the delete C sharp version. Let it compile. All right, now let's try JavaScript. So, as you can see from the graph, um, it's moving the boxes. Now it's doing a rotation around and then a scaling. The scaling really seems to tax the Unity engine. Okay, so 9,473. I think that's like almost identical to the C sharp version. And actually, I did like uh, seven or eight tests per engine before this many times. Um, I kept thinking uh, C-sharp had the edge, then I thought Unity Script had the edge, um, but it really just goes back and forth. And unfortunately, I can't conclusively say one is better than the other. They look about the same. Um, that's not really the results I wanted when I uh, went about this, but uh, it's science. You can't really, you don't want to fudge the the data, um, it looks like they are about the same performance. Um, I may do some tests later that have to do with callbacks and other things that uh, C-sharp may not have as much of an edge on uh, Unity Script with. Um, but for the moment, for the basic functions, it looks like the performance is about the same. I also taught, tested this on uh, an iPad and um, again, same. There, there are no differences, um, but I just wanted to point out a couple new features in FPS Graph. Um, this obviously, this uh, uh, breakdown of the performance results. There's also a tab you can go to for assets being used at the time. Um, let me know if you want anything else listed in the assets used. I just pulled a couple that were pretty easy to get. Um, then you can go back to the FPS Graph. And sorry about that noise. Uh, another neat thing I added was that little red dot in the corner. That's when you know a garbage collection has occurred. Um, and I'll fire up a, another example that shows that better. Uh, you may have seen this test before. It's a test between the three different tweening engines, hot tween, i tween, and mine lean tween. Um, so let's, I guess, do lean tween first. So you can see a garbage collection happens on the first frame. That pretty much happens all the time. Another one just happened. Um, this actually, these ones that just occur every two seconds or so seem to be just a unity thing. They 
you can have an empty scene and it will still do the same thing. So uh, I kind of just disregard that. Um, let's go to iTween. See, uh, you can see there's garbage collections happening like every uh, quarter second or so all over the place, and it's only animating 250 cubes. So that tells you something. Um, Lots of garbage collecting going on. Um, but yeah, one thing that was kind of impressive is uh, Hutchween actually... Oh, well, it's garbage collecting more now, but um, I had done tests in the past, and it only garbage collected kind of similar to Lean Tween. So, looks like Lean Tween is still the best on garbage collection. But... And Hotween, second best, Hotween, worst. Uh, not too surprising. Um, but yeah, the garbage collection is really neat. I thought it was fun to be able to see that. And you can also see the uh, memory being used as well. That was a feature that was already added. Okay, I hope you enjoyed my breakdown. Bye.